Yeah, guys. <laughs> yeah, guys. I'm truly. Welcome back to my channel. So today you already saw the title, but this week's content is also is gonna be Harry Potter related again. As you can see, today I'm wearing my H&M um, Hogwarts Crest um, T-shirt, and also I have my niece Type Turner. And you guys might see it's a different setup because um, our bedroom kind of changed a bit, so I. Um, made it here so also i'm just gonna show you guys my um phone case it's a marauders map phone case um but yeah um i just wanted to tell you um i'm wearing pajamas so yeah um i'm gonna be doing a harry potter collection soon if i can but let's head in today okay start recording i'm telling you guys i'm telling you guys that this video is not to hate on Hufflepuff or like me not being satisfied with Hufflepuff. I just wanted to do this again because in the previous video that I did, I think I have answered some stuff that I did not really like or, you know, I wasn't true to myself. So let's do that again. So. Okay, dusk or dawn? I am more of a, I don't know. I like I like dusk or dawn. Let's go for dusk. I don't know why. Let's just go for dusk. Ooh, it, they they made it new. How would you like to be known to history? The great, the wise, the bold, the good. Hmm. The great. How to select? Okay. Once every century, the flutterby bush produces flowers that adapt their scent to attract the unwary. If it lured you, it would smell of the sea, home, a cracking one. <laughs> it's kind of like um, a martensia, like um, you will smell who you admire. So, I don't know. Let's go home. I don't know. I am not really. I don't really. Which of the following do you find most difficult to deal with? Okay, like loneliness, boredom, hunger, being ignored, or cold. Probably being ignored or boredom. Being ignored. I don't know. I just feel like when every time, like, no one's like, you know. Huh? Choose a car category to continue. Cats toads or owls i do not like cats i'm not a big fan of cats i am uh, afraid of go toads and i'm just gonna go for owls barn owl tawny owl snowy owl screech owl the screech owl looks so like um you know majestic i don't know why but it just does look like that brown owl i'm not going for brown owl i'm not really going for snowy owl I'm gonna go for Tawny Owl, it looks cute. Which nightmare would you frighten most? Standing on top of something very high and realizing suddenly that there are no hand or footholds, nor any barrier to stop you from falling. Being forced to speak in such a silly voice that hardly anyone can understand you and everyone laughs at you. Waking up to find that neither your friends nor family have no idea, oh my gosh have any idea who you are oh that's really scary an eye at the keyhole of the dark windowless room i think this is pretty creepy but i'm not really that's not the the nightmare that would freak or frighten me most so i guess i'm gonna go to waking up to find that neither your friends nor family have any idea who you are let's see What are you most looking forward to learning at Hogwarts? All about magical creatures and how to befriend, care for them. Um, I, if there's potions, I'll go for potions. Flying on a broomstick? Probably. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go for that. Secrets about the castle. Ooh, transfiguration. 
X's and G's. There's no potions. Probably care of magical creatures or oh yeah hexes and jigs. I don't know. I want to learn them all. But you're most looking forward to this. Yeah, but yeah, I'm gonna go for this. White or black? White. Oh my gosh, I don't want to see. Oh my gosh, do you see me? I don't want to see it. Let's go continue. Yeah, guys. <laughs> yeah, guys. I'm truly in Hufflepuff. Yay! Okay, so here's the thing. First, um, the things that make me nervous about taking this quiz is when I would like get something like, you know, Gryffindor. Because some of the quizzes I got Gryffindors, most of the quizzes I got Hufflepuff, so it's between those. And if I got Gryffindor, but um, just so you know, um, before I took this quiz, I took this quiz. I promised myself that I will still stay in Hufflepuff, and <laughs> that's so funny. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy still. But there's another thing that made me think that um, I wasn't true. It's the Patronus. So yay, I'm still in Hufflepuff. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Cedric Diggory, New Scamander. Nymphadora Tonks. Only three are the famous ones. Not gonna make this video long like the one that I did before. I don't want to make it too long. Ooh, can you guys hear that? <gasps> there we go. Amazing. The Patronus is a kind of positive force, a projection of the very things that the mentors feed upon. Hope, happiness, the desire to survive by Remus Lupin. Professor Remus Lupin. Wait, yeah, Remus. Discover your Patronus. Okay, so that's the thing. So if you guys um are trying this and relax, think of your happiness. This one's really cool. I like that they did this. Glow, shine, glitter. I don't want glitter. I don't. I don't want. Sh I don't want glow. Let's go shine. Oh, sorry. Feel. Do not think too hard. Feel. Seek. Yeah. I don't know. No. Oh no. No. We didn't choose. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We didn't choose. I was so slow. Serve. Let's go serve. Serve. I don't know. We didn't choose. Bone. Blood. Bone. I don't know why I chose bone. Round. Under. Over. Around. I nearly produce a Patronus. Together. It's forming, it's forming. White. something what is a mink 
Ooh. Ooh. It's like it's like a ferret. Yeah, that that's what I was thinking. Ferret. Oh, that's cool. Let's see. That's what a mink is. Yeah, guys, that is it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to smash that like button if you like more of, if you like these Harry Potter videos. And by the way, you guys, also a little note: I won't be uploading for a long time, probably um, for a couple of weeks because we just started school, and um, I'm gonna focus more on school. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.